Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how you can export and import Power Grades in DaVinci Resolve for the iPad. So Power Grades is this amazing tool that you can use to, for example, I have an iPhone shot here that's HDR and it looks washed out, but I made already my color correction and I saved it in the Power Grade. And if I drag and drop this in, I have all of my corrections here applied to this image. Boom, I don't have to do it all by one. And the way you can get them is you have to come here into the gallery. And if you don't see the Power Grade folder, you can just simply right click here and then say add power grade album. I didn't need the second one, so I can just delete that one. And so whatever you have in your power grade, you have here in all of the future projects. It's different with the stills. Everything I put in here, so for example, if I right click on my viewer, because I'm on this clip right now, and I say grab still, it will land here, but this is only for the current project. So. The problem that we have right now on the iPad is I cannot just simply go to Power Grade and do right click here and say export because that would be the simplest way and also how you do it on the desktop. If I select here, OK, as OK, save, I get an error message, it doesn't work. But the workaround is actually very simple. You either drag and drop your Power Grade here to the stills folder or you do the same like I did. I applied it here and uh, save and grab a still because now I have basically the same and instead of a Power Grade, it's still sitting here in the stills. But now I can do right click export and go to my downloads for example i can give this a new name test power grade and then i say open and now i have this file saved as an export file and if i want to import my power grades i can just simply come in here power grade right click into an area empty and then i see this one and i can say import i can go to my downloads and now i see my test power grade and i'm looking for the bigger file it creates two files i'm looking here for the 8.3 mb file so i'm using this and now I have this file here in my power grades as well. To double check if everything works, I will delete this here and drag and drop this one onto this one. And you see, I have all of my power grades. And this is how you can export and import power grades in DaVinci Resolve for the iPad. I hope you liked this video. If yes, hit like, subscribe, ding a ding and the bam bang gong and we see us in the next video. I'm Daniel, bye.